We're back here at Morningstar Senior Living. You might recognize this guy. He may have filled a cavity or two in your mouth. This is David Hill. He lives here at Morningstar. Dr. Hill, I should say. So right. He's retired a few years ago and moved into Morningstar about 10 months ago. Now, you were saying you moved to Arizona to care for your wife who had cancer. Yeah, she was stage four cancer. And uh, they said they'd done everything they could for her. They did radiation, chemotherapy, and everything else until they said, well, there's not anything more we can do for you. And she had uh, cancer in liver, lungs, and colon. And they did operate on her and removed one tumor. And that probably prolonged her life. What was it like helping your loved one deal with death? When I had the COVID, it hurt my back and my knees to the point she needed someone to pick her up and take her to the bathroom or put her in the bathtub. And it was difficult. Uh, my son and my daughter, one of my sons, one of my daughters, John and Becky, they took time off from their work and came down because I was getting four hours of sleep a night and it was tough. Yeah. And she got to the point where she couldn't hardly eat. She couldn't talk. Um, it was it was kind of tough on her. We had to give her morphine, not an injection, but just liquid under her tongue. Sure. She said that didn't taste very good. Mm -hmm. But um, we worked with her, and uh, it was not easy. But we knew it was coming. How long were you married? 51 years. And how many children? Eight. So what was the key to a successful five decade marriage? Well, I have to say that my wife was, uh, excuse me, was quite a bit of the, of the key. Just a wonderful person. She uh, was very outgoing, warm, and loving to everybody. She knew all the grandkids' names, which sometimes gave me trouble. <laughs> and uh, she was just a very good person. She just, she made me happy. Mm -hmm. And uh, she helped in the dental practice when she was needed. And she trained dental assistants. Uh, and she was just great, that's all I can tell you. What advice would you have for newlyweds? Just watch it. Lily Wedge, believe in yourself, love that girl or that guy, and just never give up on him. Be persistent and patient. They'll never be perfect. My wife was perfect, but I was a long ways from it. And uh, she, she hung in there with me and made my life very happy, and I think there's a lot of happiness in being married to each other if you look out for each other. Well, thank you very much for chatting with me.